know one good spot to call at. I'm bringing my Savage 17 HMR, and I know the one video I had, you guys really like seeing that when I pump three shots right into the pump station on that coyote. Yeah, because another shot for me, it just means another hole. <laughs> We're going coyote hunting. It's all snowy. Going down the hill by my house right now. See that hill in the mirror? Uh, about two days ago when it was kind of nice out I jogged down here it's about a half a mile down here and I would walk down this hill and run up it as fast as I can to try to stay a little bit juicy you know you got to stay juicy and healthy if you want to go hunting and have fun so this is what we're doing man we're gonna give it one good shot before this wind kicks up any harder and maybe I can show you guys another Savage 17 Stump on a old dog. We're gonna need a hungry dog. <laughs> He's gonna need to come run into the call. Not none of this going 300 yards downwind bull crap like they always do to me. So maybe today's my day. And it's gonna be on this GoPro because my hands don't operate good when they get numb. So I'm just gonna put, I just want a button to push. I don't want to set up a big camera and all that crap. I imagine a lot of you guys know about numb fingers and they don't like to work when they're really cold like that so hey man i just seen a nice fat squirrel in the ditch over there all right maybe you'll see me in a little bit dumping a coyote over with this old 17 you know that that round that some of you guys think is not very ethical for coyotes but I probably shot 10 to 15 with my 17 it just plows them great round <laughs> I made my way down by the river I'm gonna hunt this thicket I'm setting down my Fox Pro Spitfire speaker and I'm gonna hang my old night and hail bouncing rabbit ball of fur from that tree right above it that's usually what i do to get their attention off of me and onto my little decoy that'll be bouncing The call is up ahead of me, roughly 50 to 60 yards, and right behind me is a creek leading into the river, and there's no way they can possibly get around and get my wind. So it is really the perfect setup, and that's what you need to do in central Illinois if you want to try to fool these coyotes in the woods, because they seem to go downwind 1 to 200 yards and just get your stink and you'll never see them. I called for about five minutes running the lightning jack sound and then I switched it up to screaming gray fox after a slight pause just to see if I could fool him but it didn't work. Alright guys and gals well this is pretty much my setup. It's fun hunting these suckers in the woods, the coyotes but uh, I got that collar up there just about 50 yards. Well, that's probably 40 yards. It's pretty thick down here where I'm at. So, and the wind's in my face. I got the river behind me so they can't get downwind unless they want to take a swim when it's 10 degrees outside. Um, and I'm just sitting here by the stump. I was crouched down. Stump tree. <laughs> and if they would have come in, dude, they would have probably came in over there. They would try to circle downwind on my little bouncing fur ball out there. And then I'd come in hot with the 17 on them. So that's pretty much it. A lot of the times, it don't work. 
These suckers are smart. They're either going way downwind, which they're gonna have a hard time smelling me where I'm set up, like I told you, or they're not within hearing distance. In this case, I'm gonna tell myself that they're not within hearing distance of the call. So that's it, it's just hit and miss, but coyote hunting's fun. When it, it, when it comes together, it's cool. And at 17, that's a good round for him. Get in here, I shoot him behind the shoulder just like you would a deer. If you get a good head shot, plow him. It drops him. I've shot a couple and they ran about 80 yards with a decent little blood trail and they just fall over. It's just, it's just whatever happens. <clears throat> it's a good round to go hunting with and I'm still looking. I've been here about 20 minutes. I'm about ready to get out of here because my hands are freaking numb, dude. You know, I, w I wanted to bring the new old night out here and try to s dump one good with it on a on an actual coyote set in the swamp here. But it's just too cold to be messing with my bow right now. I just wanted to try this real quick and uh, see if I can get you guys on a little kill shot, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Well. We'll give it a try tonight, maybe, or something. I just got to knock one down with 17 because I, I know you fellers like seeing that. 